Hello and welcome to British Academy. Today I'll be not showing live coding, but I will just show you how to make a flowchart in Microsoft Word. Or with other words, how to connect the connectors of a shape. Pretty much this is what I and plenty of you have seen in that in Microsoft Word we have the insert, the shapes, and even the flowchart shapes, and if we put a few of those like this, and then we add the connector, here are lines, we have connectors here, they are even named connectors, if we, even if we have add them, then they somehow do not like to be added to each other. You see, like like this and then like this you move it and it's not moved together yeah this is disgusting so there should be a better way to do it so watch us now to see how to achieve this so the answer is really simple i mean we should simply go insert shapes and here you should write new drawing canvas this is how that new drawing canvas looks like and you can start shape filling it so it is visible, like this. And anything you put in the new drawing canvas would be okay. You would be able to move it. But make sure that you put it, that the thing is kind of born inside the new drawing canvas. It's not like this. First, let me show you uh, how to change the layout for the orientation landscape. Looks better this way than a bit the percentages. Uh, okay, so you see, even if, if you do it this way, it's it's not born in the canvas, so it doesn't know and doesn't like to follow the rules in the canvas. So let's do the following, increase a bit the canvas and start putting stuff again there. So insert shapes, uh, flowchart shapes, okay, this one would be the start. We can copy it and we can put an end of the process. And insert some kind of flow chart. And our flow chart should have also, let's say, some kind of question in order to make it a bit fancier. Okay like this and now the real moment is coming putting the connector like this see just the moment I, I put this and this it is working so I can move around no that shouldn't have happened I can move around yeah like this and it works nicely so start phase one question and we have here for example phase 3 so question and for the question we can insert another one another shape like going to phase to the question like this and then for example for the question we can go either here or with something fancier like this one can go here see and if we move it will be moving around with everything the idea is that it should be green on both sides I just noticed this one and like this uh, if you don't like the style of the connector you see that tiny tiny nudge here uh, you can do you can change style I guess make it a bit bigger and say that you want the connector to be a straight one there should be a way to make it a straight connector mm -hmm. i'm just thinking how to make it a straight connector should be this one yeah this one is always straight just taking it from there putting it there and it's straight 100% of the time uh, question phase 3 
for example, we have phase four here, some kind of a phase four, and then we can also do it like this and like this. And from phase four, we can go to the end. See, it becomes green nicely, at least in one direction and in the other. In the other, it's also green. Yeah. And here, it gets green as well, easily. So yeah, just a standard drawing where you can draw stuff like this and like this and things are growing. Uh, here in the fancy tools, you can write over. This is not a fancy tool. This is Microsoft Word. So what we can do is uh, insert some kind of text. Just a quick question where the text is should be easy to find. Draw, design, shape, formats, alternative text. No. Nope. Mm. Draw text box. Yeah, this is an easy one. Question. You can say answer. Yes. Or an answer. No. So, this is how the thing looks like. And just to give it some quick sketch, you can easily do like this. And have some kind of, let's say, happy path. Strange that the happy path is with no, but it's another story. Yeah, for example. And also, these ones are also formatable. If you click Control, which I'm currently doing, you can select all of those. Shape, outline, weight, you can put it really, really big. But I guess it's not a good idea. And you can also change the dashes like this. And they are still going to be movable whenever you are happy to move them. And last but not least, if you don't like to see the canvas this way, you can say, okay, canvas, shape fill, no fill. So the canvas is not there. You don't see it because it's invisible. And yet anything is movable as you would expect it. Yeah. So pretty much that's all from British Academy on the question how to make a flowchart in Microsoft Word, how to connect the connectors to a ship. Hope you enjoyed the video. That's all folks. Take care. Have a great day. Bye.